Since we've brought you updates on the death of Matthew Mangine Jr., a Northern Kentucky high school soccer player who collapsed during conditioning last June. In March, his family launched a foundation in his honor. This weekend, a foundation event helped them raise awareness about sudden death in sports. Gary Miller has an update in our series, Athletes at Risk. Matthew Mangin Jr. It's a name a Northern Kentucky family wants you to remember. In October, a tree was planted behind the 18th green at Triple Crown Country Club in Matthew's memory. The community here is great. Uh, the support's been overwhelming. On Saturday, friends and family gathered to support the foundation by lighting the tree purple, his favorite color. It's, it's, it's been a hard couple days knowing that this is coming in anticipation. For the past month, they've been getting the word out about the foundation and its mission after the 16-year-old collapsed last June during soccer conditioning. Tell me a little bit now about the, the Matthew Mangin Jr. Foundation and, and really what your guys' purpose is going forward. Everything from Tony Pike's radio show. If you go in the dictionary and you look up the word grandson, you know, uh, Matthew's picture would be there. To training on CPR and AEDs. The only bad CPR is no CPR. Now his family is on a mission to educate on sudden death in athletes and provide life-saving tools to sidelines of local high schools. Uh, we're walking. We're not in a full sprint. So we don't stumble. Saturday was a day lit by hope for the future. Gary Miller, Local 12 News. In more than 100 stories, Local 12 has brought you coverage on why life-saving tools on the sidelines matter. To learn more about those tools, as well as the One Shot Foundation, head to athletesrisk.com.